how is everyone? I hope y'all are all having a fantastic day. Today, I wanted to share with y'all our Boxy Charm. Of course, this month it was the Boxy Luxe. So, if you are subscribed to this one, you did not get the Boxy Charm base box. So, this is $49.99 every three months. Um, and so, March, this was the first one for this year. Um, and, and every third month when you get this box, you don't get your base box. So if you're subscribed to the um, BoxyCharm base, and I think you pay $25, and then every third month you pay an extra $24.99. So that's kind of how it works. I always look forward to these. They've always been really great. Um, I will say this month it's a lot lighter than normal, and it sounds kind of empty, but that doesn't necessarily mean anything. So we will just jump right in. I had already cut it open. So that's what it looks like on the inside. And it does say Lux right there. So let's just take this paper off and that's what's inside. Our card is right on top of course. Throw that to the side. And BoxyCharm always gives us great information on the products, and I really appreciate that. Um, let's see. The I guess the theme is pretty edgy. Can't see it real well, but that's what it says right down there. So, okay, there's another thing of brown paper, so I'm going to throw that to the side also. And I will say for such a big box, it is uh, pretty empty, but like I said, that doesn't necessarily... Um, mean anything okay so this first item is from zaxi or it's zaxi by stephanie taylor and this is a pair of silver hoop earrings and they do have diamonds around half it does stop um halfway through it does say 32 dollars um on the back i don't i mean i certainly wouldn't pay 32 dollars for those and I'll be real honest, I'm not real happy to see these in my box. Um, I recently took a survey. They had sent an email um, asking, I mean, there was a ton of questions and asking if I preferred tools and jewelry and things like that. And I just, I'm not into getting stuff like this in my boxes. Um, so, and I did specify that. But anyways, there's um, those. And like I said, I'm sure that they have the price on here for, yeah, $32.00. So it just says, um, embellished with brilliant pave stones on both sides. So there you go. I will probably um, give these away. I, I've recently really gotten into gold as well. So um, those kind of wouldn't go with the rest of my stuff anymore. So, okay. Next item um, is from Invisibobble, which it's kind of ripped open, um, which that's fine, but I just cannot um, use these in my hair at all. My hair is way too heavy. Um, I'm kind of disappointed to see that in a boxy Lux. Um, those retail for $8 and there are three of those in there. Next we have from Becca. This is Skin Love Glow Glaze Stick. And I don't know if there's an actual shade name. I don't... Um, See it, maybe it will be on the inside. Let's see. Okay, I guess maybe Skin Love is the the shade. I'm not quite sure. Um, it does roll up like that, and it is just a luminizing stick. So it's a really pretty color. I just don't tend to use these. I would much rather use um, powders. So I'm not going to swatch that, and I am going to. Set that aside for someone that will. Okay, so there's that. And let's see, that retailed for $28. Wow, that's a lot. Okay, next we have from NARS. This is a Power Matte Lip Pigment in the shade Give It Up. So there's that. And let's just see what it looks like. I always love the NARS packaging. I think it always looks so nice. So there's that, really cool. And it looks like it's gonna be a really pretty pink color. And it is, it has a little bit of um, purple to it. Let's give it a little swatch here. So there's that, that is a really pretty color. Um, 
not something that I typically would wear because I'm very boring and tend to stick to shiny glosses and very um, light colors. However, my niece loves NARS and I think she'll really um, love that color. So I will save that for her. And that retails for $25. Okay, next we have from Murad. This is Hydro Dynamic Ultimate Moisture for Eyes. And this is half an ounce. And this retails for $70. That is a lot for half an ounce product. <laughs> but Murad, Murad is a little on the pricier side. So, and half an ounce for your eyes, of course, would last quite a long while. So there is the jar and let's see if it is filled. It does have a nice seal and yes, it is completely filled up. So that's good because for $70 <laughs> it should be. So, okay, there's that. And I will, I will use that, but you know, it, it's an eye cream, nothing just super exciting. So, okay. Let's see a few more things. Um, okay, next we have these two little jars here, and these are from Sol de Janeiro. This is the Brazilian Bum Bum Cream plus the Coco Cabana Cream Duo. Now, these are not full size, but I guess they're saying with two small ones it equals full size, I'm not sure. It's um, 0.84 ounces in each. Now, this one I absolutely love, and I'm really happy to get it, which I will say that is certainly not um, filled up, but oh my gosh, it smells so good. I love this stuff. Um, this we've gotten before and um, in another box. I'm not exactly sure which one. And when I first smelt it, I mean, I just thought it was amazing and smelt so good. <laughs> and then when I started trying to use it, the smell, I could not take it. and you know, you want your smelly things, perfumes and lotions to last all day, but this was so overwhelming. I could not take it. And the coconut almost started to smell like plastic or like, um, I've heard other people compare it to the jelly belly buttered popcorn flavor. If y'all have had that, which I think is so awful. As soon as I heard someone say that, a long, long time ago when I had gotten this before, I was like, oh my gosh, that is what it smells like. And typically I can make myself use products. I don't like anything going to waste, but this was one that I just couldn't even do. So I don't know. Y'all can't comment down below if y'all have tried this and if y'all like um, this scent, because for me, it was rough and I love coconut everything, but that was, um, that was not for me. So anyways, the retail, and I think for both of those together would be $15. So, okay, two more items. Next we have from BoxyCharm, this is the Hello Charmer palette. And this retails for $39, which, you know, I mean, I guess they can say whatever they wanna say, but that is what it looks like. You know, I mean, it's really cute, really simple. It does have a nice mirror there, and here are all the shades. Now, this one is so pretty. It has, um, you can see that, it's kind of like the, what do they call that? Oh, the duochrome. You see the pink and gold, very, very pretty. Um, you know, I just, um, I don't know. I don't think it's anything just like, out of this world, you know, that we haven't seen before, but I do think that it is very pretty. Um, I think that these two shades right here are really pretty. I don't want to swatch those just because I'm not exactly sure if I am going to give this away or use this palette myself. So I certainly don't want to ruin it, but it is, it is really pretty. Um, I don't think I'd pay $39 for it, but you know, to each his own. It is, um, it is pretty though. Okay, last but not least, I guess this is the big, you know, um, the big statement piece. This is from PMD Beauty, and this retails for $99. This is um, a smart facial cleansing device with over 7,000 vibrations per minute. Our Sonic Glow technology not only ensures a deep cleanse, but provides a way to lift from firm and tone problem areas for a 
more youthful <laughs> appearance. I had a hard time getting that out. Okay, so I haven't ever used anything like this before, so I will definitely try it. Um, I certainly have, you know, my, um, I think the one that I have right now is from Proactive, the exfoliator brush, and, and I love that one just fine. Um, but you know, this will be fun to try. It does have a cute little stand so you can set it up in your shower. Um, I believe it is water resistant so you can set it up in your shower or in your, um, on your counter. And I'm going to see if I can just get this going really quickly and see how strong of a vibration. It, it, it did come with a battery as well. It's just wrapped in a little plastic piece here. So there we go. I don't know if y'all can hear that or not. Okay, and it does go even higher. So that's, I mean, that's kind of neat. I guess it would, yeah, that really vibrates. Um, You know, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. I don't see why this would make so much more of a difference than like the exfoliator brush that I have. But like I said, I will use it. Oh, it also has this pulsing. Do you hear that? Okay, so that's kind of cool. There's another one. There's a fourth setting. Okay, so there's four different settings. Um, it says customizable anti-aging facial massage. So I assume you use this size for this side for that. So like I said, I will definitely use it. Um, it is waterproof, so you can keep it right in your shower. So that's what I might do with this one um, because with my proactive one, I can't um, submerge that one in water. So anyways, you know, fun to try. I certainly would not ever <laughs> pay $99 for it, but fun to try. So, um, okay, just a quick recap. We have our facial cleanser. We have our Boxy Charm little palette, our Becca highlighter stick, the NARS matte lipstick, the two um, Bum Bum cream and the coconut cream. We also have the seventy dollar eye cream, and let's not forget these two exciting <laughs> items: our silver hoop earrings and these Invisibobbles. So. I gotta tell you, this is probably the most underwhelming boxy lux that I've gotten in a very, very long time. Um, I don't know, just nothing in it very exciting to me. And I feel like we normally get a lot more than this. So, anyways, um, you know, still for 50 bucks, you definitely get your money's worth either way. So, anyways, y'all comment down below and let me know what y'all think. If y'all think this was worth $50, if y'all got it yourself. And um, also, I did get a variation eight. I know some people do like to know that. So, that's what I got. And um, so, yeah, comment down below. Let me know what y'all think about this box. And please give me a thumbs up if y'all enjoyed. And please subscribe. And we'll see y'all next time. Bye.